Alrighty YouTube, what's going on? Zero Magnum X here. Okay, I just want to say right now that <laughs> I apologize in advance, this deck is terrible, but it has been so requested, I'm just going to give the deck profile to you. Uh, this is a fun deck, I want to say that first and foremost, don't take it to a big league tournament or anything like that. The reason I made Gears in the first place is because I like their look. I enjoy the uh, the steampunk gear mechanical aspects of them. I mean, I like Dimension Police, especially Metal Borgs, because of Heavy Duke and the way they all look and everything. Uh, and that's mostly why I made this list. So that's just like a disclaimer. This is a bad deck, in a matter of speaking, as far as like competitive purposes go. However, this is a great casual deck. It's a lot of fun. Uh, just to play around with if you have a few trial decks and you can smash them together and picked up some odds and ends that are cheap It's a lot of fun to play Okay, so I just want to Go over that before we go anything. I'm gonna go over the G units first. So the main deck makes sense uh, the the entire deck is centered around the G units and If I don't have something in the main deck, it's just because I don't own it it's not because I'm trying to be cute or something. Uh, this should just have like play sets or like three ofs or anything like that. Anyway, so we have one uh, Chronos Command Dragon, two Epoch Maker, three Fate Rider. I might like add another Epoch Maker into this and only run two. Uh, it was just cheap and I picked up a bunch. So, and then two Upheaval Pegasus. This is definitely a deck that's like focused on tucking the opponent's cards, is the uh, term, like, you know, flying them beyond space and time. So here's the main deck. I use a timepiece Draco Kid. Um, this card, a lot of people, if you want to stick to the chrono theme, should be Gunner Gear, but I just don't like Gunner Gear. I mean, I like this being middle of the game in case I'm great stuck. Ta da, we found what we needed. Yes, Gunner Gear is better, but only if you're a great three. This helps me uh, not be great stuck because the deck only runs seven grade threes. So, all right, and then I only own one of this, so I only run one of it, and then I run generic criticals with the other three. But if you have four of it and you want to copy this deck for whatever reason, run four heart thump worker. Now we have four other criticals because why not? Four stand. Uh, this guy's really good. It gives you get your guys like plus ten thousand power, so I like it. It can do a lot of fun stuff. So, and it's sand trigger. Uh, not too many people expect stands these days, so it's kind of cool. Whenever they start seeing you swing with a rear guard, they're they're like, "What are you doing?" And then they see stand trigger, and they're like, "Oh." And then you know, generic four heels. So that's a trigger lineup. Let's get to the main deck. I'm not trying to be cute. They should be four Steam Maiden. I only own two. So four perfects. Do not run Quintet Walls unless you're going to be cheeky and you do the one of. But uh, even then, I still don't suggest it. Four Steam Breath Dragon because stride enablers are very important. Four Meshi, uh, these, in true Chrono fashion, these would be Mazer Gear Dragons, but I think Meshi's better. And I think if he had Meshi, he'd probably get rid of Mazer Gear or something. Uh, and then, three Misgeysers, because Misgeyser and Upheaval Pegasus is, is adorable. And that's why I run them. And that's about the only reason. I mean, it does, like, it can be front row, like, tuck something in and, like, boom, you know, 11k. So, it's not too bad. I like it. It's a three of... I'm testing it. Even though it's a generic 6k booster, this deck only really works whenever you get to grade 3. And the point of it being at grade 3 means that these get real good. Earlier on, it doesn't matter too much. Alright, uh, 4 Glimmer Breath Dragons, because this card's really good if you run Chrono Jet Dragon. I mean, I shouldn't have to explain this guy if you guys know Gears. 3 Amber, because Amber's really cool. Uh, it's still a generically good card. It still bounces things. Two, or I'm sorry, three Ishin. I like Ishin a lot because Silent Tom effects that you can just stack crits on. And if they do perfect guard your vanguard, which should be kind of big. Um, 
this sometimes can just finish the game. Again, I'm I'm talking about it in competitive terms, but the deck's not competitive. It's just it's silent Tom, folks. That's why I run it. I mean that it's straightforward. And then uh this because I need in case I need some kind of early game bounce. Like speaking of Silent Tom, if they have one, this works on both. It tucks their Silent Tom and you're in better shape or it tucks like something that you don't want out. Alright, they're just four Chrono Jet Dragon. Two Fate Wheel Dragon, because I don't have the awesome promo uh, card. That's a grade three. That is a uh, Strider, grade three. And then one Steam Maiden, because I saw it in Chrono's decks. I see it as Tech Dove 1 of in a lot of lists. So I tried it out. Anyway, that's the deck, guys. Uh, it's not competitive really it's just it's a fun deck that I made because I really like the artwork of gears and I really like the uh, the attrition kind of style that they play like I like Kagero I like Narukami and so on and so forth so I mean I'm not really drawn to cards that kind of tempo play like that so anyway please remember to favorite comment and subscribe I'm sorry this deck is uh, bad but Hopefully you enjoyed it. I'm not like discrediting it. Oh, I can't make good decks. I, I have meta decks. This one's just my fun deck. And I think that's why so many people wanted to see it. They wanted to know the inner workings. And maybe give them some different kind of ideas. I don't know. It's just been requested a lot. So here it is. Uh, if you guys want to see other deck profiles, let me know. I have the Ace slash the Cross. I have Dimension Police, I mean, I have Ezel, like, I have a bunch of cool decks that I could show off that if you are looking for something different, let me know, and I'll feature them. If you have any ones to feature any of the decks in my Card Fight Vanguard videos, uh, the games in particular, I mean, let me know, and I'll feature them. It takes me five or six minutes to record this, well, it's seven minutes, because this one's, like, a casual deck but uh and i'm just telling anyone like i'll feature deck profiles i won't be this descriptive in the other ones i'll just go through what the deck is and maybe explain some finer points but here's the uh casual gear chronicle deck i hope you guys like the upload and uh peace youtube and have a good one Pe later guys